Hello, chilly guy here. Um, welcome to England. Um, this is not really so much about the plants, it's more about what the plants need to grow in and the environment that is currently occurring over April going into May. April showers we call it here, April showers. Um, <laughs> drought, they say there's a drought. Let's have a look at the drought that we have. Not much of a drought. Here's my issue. Now this one here, um, I've, I've moved this one just over here now. It was over there and it had fallen over so I moved it here about 15 minutes ago and already it's filled up with water. And this one here basically just um, well, it managed to turn itself upside down in the wind um, last night. Um, it was completely down on the floor earlier, but I placed this one um, next to it. So this hasn't just happened. I have an issue. I've got these little grow houses, and clearly this country doesn't um, like them. When it gets really windy, it just and then it rips down the, the seams here. That I already repaired it once. Well, help repairing it once here. This one's already gone again. This one you can't. I can't buy replacements for this. I don't do the replacements on the circular ones on the top. That's an old plant. Um. Yeah, this. <laughs> it's not good. It's not good at all. If you have a look, it's actually um, rusting down inside there now because the water's gotten into it. Um, the thing that was holding it down there and there, it got completely snapped because it ripped it off out of the ground uh, where it was quite strong wind last night and that was yeah not so good this one here has also fallen over but it's less damaged actually on the plastic but the rest of it is like the this plastic this plastic's gone it's knackered this one's going also as you can see rips down the side there cannot grow really in this type of weather it's it's terrible um, I did test one of the tomato plants out here uh, just to see what it would do. It was one I didn't really need. And it's completely toppled over. And it's being crushed currently by the grow houses. So, yeah. Not very good. So, I'm going to cut these up. And if anyone's. I mean, I've tried everything. That, that one there, I've tried to put it. There's nothing actually in them at the moment, apart from that old pot there. If they had had plants in them, they would be everywhere now and probably destroyed. Um, it's going to be like this pretty much now until June, July, and still then it, it might be windy and rainy. I mean, we've got predicted snow, apparently, in um, May. So that's only next month, which is crazy. But that's what I've heard. Um, yeah, I've tried screwing it down. There's some screws there, screwing it down. It's ripped plastic apart though, doing that. I tried putting a rock in there to hold it down. Uh, it's closed. I don't, the wind's getting up and under it somehow. I don't, know, I don't really know what to do. I mean, the winds here have taken fences down before, so... I mean, that trellis thing there is a new one, because only a few years ago it completely ripped that apart. So yeah, I might just have to put up with it. It's not much else I could think of, but yeah. Anyway, 